This is quality content, and I'm not just saying that because I'm winning. Where's the quality? <laughs> Everything I've said to every one of your videos. Are you crying or what? Mm, I'll take or what. Great move. Great move. Okay, maybe, not. maybe not. <laughs> maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not really. At least we can all pretend like it is, right, guys? Hey, you're gonna flag. Like, shush. Shh. Don't tell them the facts. It just. <laughs> it's like a draw. I'm probably gonna blunder <laughs> something. No, he's gonna flag. He's gonna flag. No, he's not. You're gonna get queen of four. He's gonna lose. Serkan's gonna lose. Yeah, yeah. Wow. I didn't want to play queen f4. You didn't want to what? Let's just win the bishop card. Or the queen, whichever works. Yeah, Yeah, like... Okay, GG's. What are you doing? Nice move. <laughs> yeah, made it do. Dude, 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 just like, dude, yeah, just get ten knights. Okay, there we go. Made him one. <laughs> game. Made him two as well. Wait, where? Huh? Yeah, queen b in your piece. Oh, okay. Or queen b seven. <laughs> Hey guys, Brian here, and let's go over the game to see what we can learn from it. Um, so in this position, black moves rook e5, and if you want to pause the video and find the tactic for white, I think Trey mentioned it in the uh, video, but in case you guys didn't see it. So when you're looking for tactics, obviously, first thing you look for are checks. So you got the check here, and uh, black king is going to pick up the bishop, and you've got the uh, discovered attack here. So... White will be up a rook. Um, and also, when we think of tactics, we usually think offensive, but defensive tactics are, are a good thing to do here too. So in this position, um, white moves queen e4 check. And in the game, this was black's last chance to, um, to basically make it a game. After this, it was pretty much over for white as long as white played. Well, so if you want to pause the video and find the defensive tactic for, for black in this position, you can do so now. And let me guys give you a hint. It'll solve a problem that black had for throughout the entire game, basically. Alright, in the game, King G8 was played, and that totally looks good from a human point of view, right? That, that looks about right, but... If you play it, if you play f5, then this solves a problem that Black had for a while, and that is simply g takes, and then the rook. This rook comes back in the game. This rook was kind of, you know, had a trouble activating itself the entire game. But with this um, kind of defensive tactic, Black is now back in the game, and um, King just goes back to g8, and yeah, White is just up a pawn at this point and black can kind of make a game out of it from this position so um, you know it's always fun to learn offensive tactics in chess but also kind of I think it's important to kind of learn these defensive tactics too to kind of bring your inactive pieces back in the game to defend and kind of you know try try the game from there so hope you guys enjoyed the game hope you guys enjoyed the analysis and um, I guess the lessons to take away from this game are kind of you know Tactics always look for the checks first, and um, defensive tactics, right? Try to uh, make moves that defend, but also bring your inactive pieces back into the game. So those are the two lessons. Hope you guys enjoyed the game. Hope you guys enjoyed the analysis, and I'll see you guys later.